think we should. I think we should. Hey, man. Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I expected a kid I, talking I, after I said that. <laughs> so I hit start. And you went, yeah, I think we should. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to a crab's um, one necklace that he's looking for. Um, it's a shell? Yeah, um, no, I'm being dumb. Shut up, I'm EP. Um, That's different from you your usual. Yes, I am. Yes, I am, because I was an idiot. Because I was, I, was, I was an idiot, and instead of instead of saying instead of just accepting my eight p.m. to twelve a.m. shift at, at Macca's last night, I instead said to my boss who asked me, "Hey, can you stay till ten till six thirty? I said, "Yeah, okay, sure, sure. <laughs> Why not? Yeah. Maybe I can get a fraction close to being a millionaire with that." <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we can get one twentieth of the way there. Maybe. Oh my god, Rylan. I get to like actually teach on Wednesday. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. I'm running like an activity with the kids and I don't know what to do yet. But I'm so excited. That's awesome. This guy's voice, like when he's not actually talking, he's just Anyway, I'm gonna be working almost every day next week. Nice. Because I'm roughing Monday, Tuesday. Wednesday I'm teaching and Alika said I can't ref after teaching because I'm refing all day Thursday. That's a good call. Yeah. And then Friday I have nothing at the moment. But still, I am going to make more money than him next week. That's awesome. <laughs> I'm so happy. Okay. For, I'm so happy for your lantern fish. You should become like a referee or something. You'd get more no, money. No. No. You'd get more money. I'm very bad at calling shots on the spot. Very bad. Yeah. And then I, I was bad at doing it with goal umpiring. That's goal umpiring for footy. You just stand there. <laughs> yeah. you, you literally just stand there. If the ball goes in between these two things, oh, goal. Those two things, point. That's and, the whole job. And 95% of the time... Okay, sorry, sorry, I don't care about stuff. 99% of the time I did well. It was literally one instance, but that one instance playing in my head on repeat. It was literally the whole... Um, and I, I remember it clearly. The ball, the ball hit the post. It did hit the post. This is my guilty confession. If you're um, some random person from a team who versed the Jets, like, fucking... Four years ago, five years Been ago. If you're some random player who played that and thought then thought this one game was bias, it was. Um, the ball hit the post. It was from the team that my brother was playing on. It, the ball it did hit the post. Easily play play off the ball about it not hitting the post, but I saw from my angle it did hit the post. The referee looked at me like goal point. And I was like, um, and I was still trying to process what just happened. And then the guy who kicked the goal, he looked at me like, goal, goal. I was like, yeah, it's a goal. It wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't. And in case you're saying, oh, the results couldn't have affected it that much, they won by four points. <laughs> so, yes. <laughs> so, yes. <laughs> uh, they, If I didn't give that to them, they would have lost. So, um... Did they go? Did they go on to the grand finals in that match? In that in that in that season? Yes. Did they win the grand final? No. <laughs> no. Ha <laughs> ha. I just thought of something else that I'm doing in July. Oh God, what? Sixth of July, I've got my basketball course. Remember that? That's what I was missing yesterday. Oh God. I don't remember. Uh, I've gone back to watching One Piece. Properly. I'm on whole cake now. Um, our Tivoli friend is ahead of you. Okay. Just... I, okay, saying. I also... My life is way busier than his. <laughs> it's, like, okay. way busier than his. Um, I'll just say I just that think it was funny. Our Tivoli friend's ahead of me in one piece now. Oh. And I said, okay, but my life's also, like... Busy. She's making a point. Fair enough. Oh my God. I'm going to be getting my tattoo on Wednesday the 3rd. It all meant to, like, ref run around on Best Sweaty for, like, a week afterwards. Two weeks. I have a ref course on Saturday the 6th. Oh. That's fun. I actually want to stab someone. Well, that... Didn't you make that call? 
Yeah, and I forgot about it until literally just then. Because right. I was thinking, oh, more money, because after I do this rough course, I'm going to be getting... I love that logic. I forgot. I better stab someone. <laughs> you fit Togo well. <laughs> you, fit, you fit Togo well. That's Togo logic. I forgot. Better stab. Also, Togo was Why weird. Why are you facing that way? Togo was weird in the anime. I've read all of the manga and it's actually finished now, and... Yeah. Yeah. Something that happens with her is... He. Yeah. Oh, no. What happened? Have you... I don't want to... I, I, you want me to spoil? Well, I want to know. I don't care. It's my hair. The, the, the fandom's forever yes. ruined. Yes. The, you want the, me to spoil the, what happens? The yeah. fandom's forever ruined the manga for me, or the anime Yeah, the me. fandom sucks, but the show's... Not bad. The show's not bad, but I can't watch it now. It's like Taylor Swift. The fans have ruined it for me. I can't enjoy it now. Do you want to know what happens? Yes. Go. Her and, um... Uraka are fighting. Mm -hmm. And... Uraka is, like, losing. And then they were, like, having the conversation of, like, love and shit. Because they both, like... Um... Midoriya. Yeah. And she's like dying, and then she gives up her life and blood for her. So Tug is dead. Oh. What? Yeah. For Uraka. For Uraka. <laughs> what the hell? Damn. Ew. What? It hurts. Yeah. Yo. I wasn't really paying attention to the boss fight, mother. <laughs> I was more paying attention to this. What the hell? And you know the leader of the League of Villains? Yeah. The guy that wants to touch everyone? Yeah. <laughs> He's also dead. Disintegrate. What, what, what did Disintegrate do? He died happy, though. Wait, what, what, what? He was fighting Izuku as the final fight, and he was trying to help him, and he did end up helping him. But then he... Couldn't like keep living. Wait, straight Shigaraki. He just kind of disintegrated. <laughs> oh my god, damn. Because he was fused with all for one. Oh. So the whole League of Villains is dead. Awesome. But, oh, even twice? Twice died way before the final battle. No! And, um. Twice, my boy! And, um. <laughs> Togo <laughs> uses Twice's blood in the fight and turns into Twice. <laughs> oh, not TJ's crying. And you know the shadow guy that teleports everywhere? He's a racer head and what's his face? The guy with the voice, the speakers. Yeah. Like, childhood friend. Yeah, he does. And he dies helping them. No. Wait, wait. Does the racer head die? No, but he loses his powers. Oh, damn. That sucks. And... What the hell? Wait, this is go All Might, and... Izuku are, like... Disabled. <laughs> <laughs> and... Bakugo might not be able to use his powers properly anymore. Izuku will lose one for all. He is, like... Only has, like, the embers left, like All Might did. So, All Might fought All for One in like a suit used that has like the powers of all the students, like inbuilt into it. It was like a cool moment of like a student and teacher like thing. He uses all the things. And then he gets. And then he's like about to die to All for One. And then Bakugo was like dead ages ago. Someone restarts his heart, I can't remember who. And he flies in and saves All Might. Damn. What the hell? Yeah. Whole lot of stuff. That's hectic. Damn. Yeah. Damn. What about Darby? Did Darby die? Darby is um. Yeah, I know. It's Fire Hot's brother. Yeah, I know. I know. Did you not know this? No. You know, you wonder where she read up to. Where? The fight between Izuku and him at the like school festival. That's where she's run up to. Oh, God. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm, like, not, like... Yeah, he's Toya. Because I couldn't get the book. Yeah, Darby's, Darby's, Darby's Toya. Darby's Toya. Darby's Toya. 
Dude, and there was a whole family <coughs> moment where they're trying to help him. Yeah, and they're trying to fight everyone in that family. Hey, hey. What the hell? <laughs> everyone in the family comes in and sees him and is like, what are you doing? It's being stupid. We all love you. I'm done with my fucking life. So does Darby die? Yeah. He does. He explodes. Because <laughs> he builds up fire inside of himself trying to kill Endeavor. So, and, and like to explode a huge radius. Oh, wow. And so he does. Damn. <laughs> what the fuck? Man. Yeah. I require a snack after that. Yeah. Damn. Wait, is it, wait. No, actually, no, I'm not going to ask that part. This is... This. <laughs> what, ma'am? Bless you. The honey tiny teddies are the best flavor. No, you're wrong. No, you're wrong. Can't be more. Can't. You couldn't be more wrong. You're wrong. You couldn't be more wrong. What flavor are you? Chocolate. No. Yes. Mm -mm. I'm on the weird side of it. Chuck chip. Ew. It's the best. Dude, what? No. Can we like sack him? Yeah. Yeah. No. What? That's funky. That's funky. Yeah, sack me. Who's gonna play the game? No, I'm sure TJ can. Is, oh my god, I had an idea for... There's now TJ and Rowan's YouTube channel. Alex has been sacked off. I had an idea for our last episode. The last video of today. Oh yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Uh, don't say it. Yeah. I'm not gonna. Good. <laughs> I didn't actually burp. That's not really convincing. Wah! Oh, wah! Alright, bitch. Okay. The best tiny teddy, like, face is when he's grumpy and fat. Yes! Yes. Mm. That's oh, you're using it. I am using it. Yay! I, I'm glad my birthday gift wasn't a waste. Because that was all I was worried about. Literally, the day after, I tried out all of the colored pens and highlighters and stuff. Yeah, she oh, did. Yay. I went to Office Works for those. Like, I actually probably went to Office Works and, like, I love them. I probably like when I okay, which ones look pretty and also look effective. <laughs> so <laughs> these look fair. I like them. Um oh something something that I can something that I can um something that I can say through um something sorry I can say through um joke so much damage. Sorry, sorry I can say through joking of ha ha while coping with it. Um guess who's guess who's for, for the first time ever decided waking up from anxiety? Me Winning It's winning it sucks. It sucks. I wake up and I'm like, oh, okay, I guess my alarm's meant to go off in like maybe 10 minutes from now, all good. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. Well, <laughs> no, that's not it. Yep. That's... It happens to me every night. That's fun. Um, mine, hasn't, mine hasn't happened through... Um, mine hasn't happened through anything... Like, mine hasn't happened unreasonably yet, though. But something that is alarming is that my anxiety is developing, <laughs> which is not fun. I wake up checking if he's alive most nights. I get the feeling I'm going to do that when I get a girlfriend. I get the feeling I'm going to evolve into that. But at the moment, I, for example, the most recent one was when I went to Nova, which was so awesome, by the way. I actually got to meet um, Nathan and Sean. That, oh, that, was, cool. that was awesome. They're such funny guys. Um, but because of that, because it was such like a big thing, I woke up four times that night. Mm. All because I was like, what do I wear? Do I look presentable? Um, ah. Uh -huh. I wake up every night checking if he's alive and if the dogs are alive. Nice. Every time. I used to do it to mum, my sister, and our dog. Yeah. And now I do it for him. Nice. Not nice. Scares the shit out of me. Oh, well, yeah, but, you know, it shows that you care. Mm. I try to look at the bright side of it, but you're alright, it's not good. <laughs> But Harley lays really still, and if he's not snoring, I hate that. If he's not snoring, I really think he's dead, and I have to wake him up to make sure that he's alive. To give my full, to get to to, to, to to relate to that to another level, my so you guys you guys know Ziggy, mm. loud as hell snorer, mm. and he loves sleeping in my room. Times when I'm back like watching YouTube or I'm playing games, and like I notice something's a bit off, I'll like turn down the volume, I'll hear nothing, and I'll look around the room, if Ziggy's not in my room anymore, I'm like, okay, cool, he must have wandered up when I was about 10, whatever, but if Ziggy is in my room, he's lying on the floor, and I'm not hearing him, I have to, like, hyper-focus on him to see if his body's moving with his breathing, 
and it scares the hell out of me because he is getting old and his eyes are screwed, everything's screwed. So it's like, oh, who cared about? This guy's shooting on me. It's great. And like, I'm on this new medication as well. Mm -hmm. And it's not doing shit for me. Oh. It's okay. Like, it's not doing anything other than like making my emotions 20 times more powerful. Like, yes, I get less random thoughts in the middle of the day of yeah. like, like bad thoughts, whatever. Yeah. But when I do get thoughts, it makes it 20 times more powerful. Oh, that's not fun. Yeah. Oh, uh, great. What a great topic, topic to talk, talk about in a YouTube video. Let's, Let's go. go. Alex, right. shift the topic now. Oh, he's in the air. In the air. I'm fighting Okay, actual, actual, actual good debate, debate topic, topic, actually. You know what? Good debate topic to segue into out of that out of that conversation. What? Planes or boats? Like, for me to be on? Yeah, just travel. Just travel. Like, Generally, planes or boats? Planes. Because I can't swim. I get seasick. I can't swim. I couldn't. Planes or boats, Alec? Boat. Oh my, of course! You look like, like a boat, boat person. person. I hate being on a plane because it hurts my ears. Then get good. Do, 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 do you not? Do you not? Do you not? Told you not. I this. hate doing that. It hurts. I it hurts. I've never gone on a boat before. I've been on a kayak once. And I, was, I almost died. I was going to say, that would have been a harrowing experience. <laughs> General rule of thumb, don't go on any body of water if you don't know how to swim. I was with someone who was a very skilled, okay. licensed life In that case, then, okay, that's valid, fair enough. But it was the only way we could get to our camping spot. Oh. Fun. So, it was part of our karate tournament. We had to go over there. And so, I had to go to kayak with Sensei Smiley. Sensei Smiley? Yes, his nickname was Sensei Smiley. Nice. He's smart a lot. He is hey, the nice. nicest guy ever. And he made sure like the boat was steady and whatever and you know, made me feel a lot safer than I would have. Yeah, fair enough. But still I would never want to do it again. That's fair. That's that's fair. Um yeah. the I'm scared of the beach. I'm scared of the fish that swims into your penis when you're at the beach. <laughs> that's that's in Thailand. <laughs> I, we're not in Thailand. I, you never know. That's in Thailand. You never know. That fish is only native to Thailand. You never know. Fish migrate. Not to Australia. Do you realize how? Do you realize how like specifically you need to be as a fish to migrate to Australian waters? Like Australian waters are all over the fucking show with their temperatures and everything. So you need to be a very specific shit. Unless you're like you're like a, just a like a biodiverse like fish, like a great white and all that. If you're culture like for example, the penis swimming fish, they are literally native to Thailand. They could only live in Thailand waters. If they went to Australian waters, they'd not only get eaten up by everything surrounding Australia, because Australia is home to like animals, like God literally injected danger into animals here. But also because our waters are so fucking <laughs> that they die. That's Is that the whole like you, you know what happens when you bring up a um, like a midnight zone fish to to our sea level, right? Yeah. They just blow up because mm. the pressure. It's, it's the same as blowfish. Yeah, they just blow up. And people make fun of them because of how ugly they look. They are so cute when they're like in the water. Okay, okay. okay I think they're cute at all times. Okay. I'm not going to say they're cute. I'm not going to say they're ugly. They're very funny looking. <laughs> I find them funny as fuck to look at. <laughs> if, I, if I saw one... Did I tell you guys a jellyfish story? Jellyfish um, story. So I went to Rod Nest. Um, first time going to Rod Nest. Very underwhelming. Because um, I, was, I was told so many good things about Rod Nest. And when I first went for the first time, it was like year 11. And I went there. I was like, wow, that was it. Okay. Um, but one of the things we did go to Rod Nest was we did snorkeling. And there was a beach that was there, which the beach was beautiful to snorkel and cruise. Like, the water was clear as hell on that day. Um, there's actually, like, fish to see as well. So it's very, very nice snorkeling. Um, didn't, oh, no, this wasn't Rotnest. 
No, this isn't Mindari. Never mind. Um, but regardless, Rodness was still a fun experience, but it was still underwhelming. But anyway, this story type was in Mindari. We were snorkeling, and we were snorkeling as a group. And um, our teacher had had our teacher had like been like telling us like they'd been monitoring how we'd been doing well, and he did say there was few people who he trusted to go off by themselves or to lead certain like a finite number of people yeah. because they were in that care and I was lucky enough to be in, in that list because I'm a good swimmer with snorkels so I went there and so me and my mates um, well, these mates were also on that list as well so we just kind of just vibed yeah. uh, we went off ahead and we decided to swim and um, and I forget what happened but one of them stopped and they were like yeah no I'm not going any further and I was like oh that's boring so I went to it. I swam, I swam, I swam, I swam. And, oh, that's right, because she was scared of the ocean. Um, oh. um, oh, to, to help play into being scared of the ocean. Oh. It has laser eyes. Oh. Anyway, um, so as we were snorkeling, I looked to my right and there's nothing. I'm like, okay, well, there's nothing going on here. And I looked to my left and I kid you not, there was a jellyfish about the size of Harley. 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 Sorry. There's a jellyfish the size of Harley. Just Jesus. next to me. Harley's a chunky boy. No, but like, no, lengthwise. Uh, right next to me. I was like, oh. Jesus. I paddled fast because like, I was worried it was going to sting me. Yeah. Paddled fast. I freaked out the fuck out of so many people because they're like why is Violin <laughs> so fast towards us <laughs> they want us like a shark or something I was like no nah, it's just a jellyfish relax I just over exaggerated anyway next time are we going to address that big spider crab thing yeah next time next time next time cool ah! uh-